Hi guys! In today's video, I'm going to prove to you that it is very easy to get enough protein on a vegan diet. No supplementation, no protein powders, just delicious, wholesome, plant-based foods. I'm going to show you three delicious meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks, and show you my protein calculations at the end. So you can rest assured that you will be getting enough protein on your vegan diet. This video is sponsored by Thrive Market, where I buy my vegan non-perishable ingredients. And if you use my link down below, you can get $60 off on groceries plus free shipping and a full free month membership to Thrive Market. So make sure you use that because it is amazing and you can get so many great things to make your lovely vegan meals. Let's get started with breakfast. For breakfast, I'm gonna make one of my favorite things, avocado toast. There is a wide range for how healthy bread can be. Something like this simple sourdough is great. After toasting the bread, score the avocado and mash it with a fork. Top with cooked chickpeas, spices, and a drizzle of tahini. Avocado toast is such a wonderful thing to have for breakfast, especially when it's on that sourdough bread, you got the avocado, and I added some chickpeas on top and tahini, really just to bulk it up even more. It's got enough protein on its own and got enough nutrients on its own, but it's that fiber that you want. It's gonna keep you fuller for longer throughout your day so you can be not hungry like an hour after you've had your breakfast. So add that stuff. Also, the avocado and the tahini are great healthy fats as well. A salad can make a great, filling, tasty, nutritious meal if you bulk it up. It will provide you with plenty of protein and other essential nutrients. To make the dressing, start with the juice of half a grapefruit. Add pomegranate molasses, olive oil, maple syrup, and spices. See the description for the whole recipe. Shake vigorously to combine. In a large bowl, combine arugula, fresh parsley, dill, and mint, black lentils, cooked farro, and sweet potatoes. And drizzle the dressing and toss. And top with toasted pumpkin seeds. Mm. So, eating things like this, a really nice bulked up salad with whole grains, legumes, you know, I added my uh, pumpkin seeds in here and lots of fresh herbs and different types of greens. I got plenty of protein in this and I also got fiber and other nutrients like minerals, vitamins, phytonutrients, antioxidants. If you want to bulk up, you know, you're trying to like it all fit in like big, then it's not about needing to like specifically add, you know, protein powder to your diet or anything like that. It's really as simple as you need to probably eat more food. Same thing if you're pregnant. And when you eat the food, just make sure it's well balanced like what I'm having right now. Because as you can see in the breakdown, there's plenty of protein here. There's plenty of fiber here. There's plenty of healthy fat fats. You'll get everything you need. You just might need to eat more depending on your activity levels. People are always talking about how important protein is to bulking up and having like a lean muscular physique, but fiber is overlooked. Fiber is very important if you wanna have plenty of healthy muscle on your body. So make sure you're getting plenty of that as well. Of course, I have all three meals, but I also need to have snacks. So one thing I love to snack on are raw nuts. These are almonds. They've got a lot of nutrients in them. Of course, protein, also fiber, healthy fats like vitamin E as well. And for when I want something a little sweeter, I love to grab a piece of fresh fruit, like a banana. Simple, sweet, and delicious. 
For dinner, let's make red beans and rice. Start by chopping up all your vegetables. Saute the onions, garlic, bell pepper, and celery in oil. Once they're cooked through, add the beans, bay leaves, and dried thyme. And add lots of water or vegetable stock. Cook covered for about 45 minutes. When the beans are soft, fry the vegan sausage. Add spices along with the sausage to the beans and continue to cook for about 10 to 15 more minutes. Serve with rice and fresh parsley. So I love eating rice and beans for dinner, especially New Orleans style red beans and rice. And by the way, this combination makes up a complete protein. It's delicious, it's hearty, full of protein, full of fiber, and full of other nutrients like B vitamins, which are very great. They give you lots of energy throughout the day. And oh, I added the field roast sausage, you know. Uh, you don't have to add that. Even if you're trying to get a lot of protein, the beans and rice alone are plenty. And get this, even if I didn't eat dinner today, I would still hit my protein goals for the day, like the recommended daily value of protein. Even if I just had breakfast and lunch. So there you go, super easy to get all the protein you need. But of course, I wouldn't want to skip dinner, especially not when it's one of my favorite dishes. So for all of those meals, the three meals plus snacks, my calories came up to 2,088 calories. Um, here, check this out for the protein though. 87 grams of protein. No protein powders, no protein bars, just wholesome foods. 87 grams of protein and the recommended daily value for somebody with my, uh, my activity level, my size, my age, gender is 49 grams. Okay, so obviously it can be done. And uh, for fiber, which is also extremely important, I think more important, I got 69 grams and the recommended daily value is only 25. So there you have it. It's so easy to get everything you need. And next time somebody asks you, hey, where do you get your protein? Send them this video, okay? Also, you can send them the accompanying blog post where I go into more detail about my protein for every one of these meals. You can see it all written down, um, all the other macronutrients and the other nutrients that I got. It is really just so easy. So hopefully, if you've been worrying that you're not getting enough protein as a vegan, hopefully this proves to you that as long as you eat a whole food, plant-based vegan diet, you will be Good. Thanks again to Thrive Market for sponsoring this video. Make sure you check out the link for the $60 off groceries down below, along with the link to my blog post that goes into more detail around this whole protein issue, plus the recipes for all the food that I ate today. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And make sure to subscribe to my channel and leave a thumbs up. Oh, and make sure to turn on your notifications so that you don't miss my next videos. Okay? I will see you guys soon and talk to you soon. Bye!